What's up, YouTube? This stuff's awesome. This uh, bread ties stuff has multiple multi purposes, mainly to tie up like right there on your plants like that there. But check this out. I uh, was trying to figure out how I could get this. Uh, I took a plant outside, you know, the one that I called the shit. So I uh, took some bread ties and I lowered the light string down because I was like, how the hell can I get my CFLs to lower down? But now look at it. Now my regen right here. Gen the regen. Yeah, look at that. Yeah, you can see some, uh, it's going to take a while, but, you know, you can already see it regening right there. And right there, I know I need a better camera. One day, this one's better than the cell phone camera. See, I, that's where I snipped it right there. That kind of causes disease, but, you know, I wanted to lower it down. Like, reeling for you always says, how come we don't lower it? And it is kind of dangerous because I got it on an old ice cream container, but as long as nobody moves, nobody gets hurt. If nobody moves, nobody gets hurt. But yeah, that looks a hell of a lot better there. See, so look right here. When I put the camera right here, you can see the purplish blue right there. You can see all the spectrums and the light bulbs. See right there like that. But yeah, isn't that cool? I know the punt looks like shit. It's supposed to look like shit. It's a regen. Regens aren't meant to look pretty. So, yep. Yeah, I'm getting there. So, yeah, that's a hell of a lot closer right there. It's about six inches away. Technically, I could get a hell of a lot closer than that, but am I going to? Nope, not really. That should be fine right there, and we'll see how it does overnight. Hopefully, it won't uh, fall off or break or anything, but, yeah, I think CFLs are the future of uh, indoor gardening. So, uh, they've got a high amount of lumens. They're hella bright, you know. They're uh, real similar to... Uh, Okay, they're not similar to high pressure sodium, but they are hella bright. You gotta admit that, like right there. there. And I've, I'm only invested $7 plus the $7 cord right here that goes all the way up, so that's $14 plus the $7 circuit breaker, so 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, $21 invested. So, you know, it doesn't take a lot of money. Oh, and the Y splitter, so you're looking at like 23 bucks total, something like that. And then you could technically use Miracle Grow or something like that. You're in at about 25 bucks fairly cheap way to grow uh, tomatoes, strawberries, anything you want. So uh, the white splitter is a hell of a way to, to go too. There's a little 13 water right there. Or you can go this route, 70 bucks, Amazon.com, a hood and CFL combo. Last year, one to two years. You know, replacement's only $38. So, yeah, any, any, either way. So, but hell yeah, that's cool. I'm really uh, liking this here. It's pretty, uh, should, it should do better. It's real close to a uh, Real close to the light now. All right, guys. Thanks for uh, watching and uh, babysitting me and putting up with my shit. So I'll see you guys on the flip side. Peace.